those uh, those last couple free throws there for you uh, tr proved to be the difference. You guys had been struggling not only from the free throw line but also from the floor. So what are you telling yourself when you're in that situation? Um, well, I think the student section and all the noise at that close of a game really has to like uh, really affects us during those. So when I'm at the line, I kind of just tell myself it's just like practice because um, and then I take a deep breath. Because I know at practice we really focus on making them after sprints so that we're tired. So at the line I just tell myself it's just like practice and I try and block out the noises behind me. are bubbling a bit when you can't hit your shots either as a team. I mean, what are you guys telling yourselves to keep yourselves in a close game? Um, just again, just take a deep breath and just act like it's at practice. You know, like don't rush your shots. If it's not there, it's not there. You know, like we really focus on sharing the ball and not focusing on like racking up your own points. So I think for our team, one big thing is that we share the ball really nicely, and um, the shot's not there. Like we just don't really take the defensive effort tonight, and the way what you guys did to them. Uh, yeah. So during practice, I mean, going into it, we knew that their posts were going to be their best players. So um, our biggest goal was just to front them the entire time, and we knew we weren't going to totally shut them out because they are taller. But we just were going to front them the entire time and try our best for them not to get the ball and box them out every shot went up. That went up.